hi welcome back to my channel uh, today's video is going to be another fact about an African country but before we get into it can I ask you please to subscribe down below I upload videos about Africa the black community and growing as a whole so if you're interested in videos about those topics please do subscribe down below it does help out my channel so now today's video is going to be about none other than Burundi this is the last um, B country in Africa soon we'll be moving on to C so um, please do stay tuned for that and let's get into it located on the southern eastern part of Africa um, its official languages are French and Kurundi and it is bordered by Rwanda, Tanzania and the DRC. The main religions are Christianity and Islam and the capital city is Bujumbura. Also the currency used there is called the Burundian franc. The country has three national parks which are called the Kiriva, the Revubu and the Rusizi. The Kagera Falls, the, <clears throat> the Kagera Falls, which are located on the southern part of the country, are one of the country's highlights. About 90% of the country relies on agriculture. This is an interesting one. Group jogging is actually banned in the country as the government believed that it would be a way of people um, creating anti-governmental um, plots and conspiracies. Cattle are seen as a sign of happiness, health and prosperity and there's a famous saying in the country which is Amashio which um, translates loosely to may you have many um, cattle or may you have many herds of cattle. Now there are three different main ethnic groups in the country. The main ethnic group is the Hutu which are about 85% percent of the population and then you have the Tutsi tribe which is about 15 percent of the population and then less than one percent of the population are indigenous people. Burundi is one of the smallest countries in Africa. Lake Tanganyika in Burundi is an African great lake and it's considered to be the second largest freshwater lake in the world. Drumming is a very important part of Burundi culture. The country's people are known as Burundians. Meat accounts for less than 2% of the um, country's food intake. Beer is an integral part of social interactions and it's quite common to see people drinking beer with straws. The country imports almost three or four times uh, the amount that they export, which is a shame because they have so much land and 90% of the population are doing jobs within the agricultural sector so it doesn't make sense and finally when a cow dies in Burundi it's common to see that the horns of the cow are buried near a house um, as they believe it brings good luck so thank you for watching my video um, I hope you liked it if you did please like share subscribe and all that good stuff and I shall see you in the next one bye